So our team is Code Review Cupid. Um, so why, why does this project exist? So as research software engineers, many of us, or researchers, or people who write code, we find that it's often difficult to find someone who can help us with what we've written, read over it, see if it makes sense, and maybe give us some tips. So this is kind of a bad situation to be in, and we might find that if we find someone who can code review, they're often too busy or they don't have time to, to add yet another review to their pile. So we want to address this problem. We want to make it easier for people who write code and want reviews to find each other so that they can have kind of help each other in a complementary way to make the code review process a bit more sustainable. So this is really our idea. It's about connecting people so that they can help each other. And our solution is basically to propose a buddy or pairing system where we take people's expertise and see who else would match with that person and can contribute to the expertise that they're missing. So we ask users to provide information, we generate a profile, and then taking the skills that people feel that they're able to contribute and to, uh, to give others, we also take the skills that they want help with. So for example, you might have a user who is great at documentation, but doesn't feel as confident with testing their code. And then we, with an algorithm, are gonna match these people up and put them in touch with each other so that they can then go forth and make use of all of the uh, kind of community resources, such as the research code review community, documentation process, and other things that already exist to tell people how to do great code reviews. But really, we're trying to solve this problem of how people can find each other. So how have we done that? Uh, I'm going to pass over to uh, Sherman. Hello, thank you. Sherman speaking. Hello. So we went for web design. This is because everybody uses the web. And, and also multiple devices use the web. So you could, uh, you could also use this product on your phone. Uh, in terms of data, the user would input the data through the website and then which is sent to an SQL database, which does the number crunching and then spits out the results or the matchmaking results back to you through a web interface. Um, in terms of documentation, we provided a way to instructions on new users to, on how to use the website and also how to maintain the code in the future. And then um, uh, for the future and for the future and our on our to-do list, we have to do some housekeeping. So for example, codes of conduct, um, licenses, all sorts, um, small prints, lawyers look at, but we don't, um, such as G GDPR, data security. Oh my goodness, that's a lot. Yeah, um, but, that's, but that is a necessary thing to do in the future. Um, we also like to implement a scoring system. So you can imagine people chasing likes on Facebook and Instagram. We want to copy that psychology where people want to be the top of the class when reviewing code. And we also want to look at how we can match different people uh, looking at different algorithms such as um, NLP, looking at comparing people's bio or even comparing pe different people's um, um, social media such as GitHub or Twitter. I'll pass over to Janetta, who shall demo the product. Yeah, go ahead and share your screen, Janetta. So I hope you can all see this uh, screen. Good, good. Um, so in the little time we had, we uh, created the website that is being hosted on Heroku, but could potentially be hosted anywhere. So it's very important to notice that we even have a favicon there on the little tab in the top left hand corner. So as we uh, push our code to Git, it's automatically deployed to Heroku and our web uh, site gets updated. Our web app has a Java backend using Spark Java for serving a REST API. So this makes for a nice model view controller design. For the moment, our demo pages are static, uh, created with a mixture of plain HTML and velocity. And we have an SQL database in the background that could potentially be replaced by any other database, which we have not yet linked. Uh, so shown here is our land, landing pa page, and if we create, uh, click on create profile, this is where the person will add, any person will add their data and submit that to our database. 
Um, our um, clever algorithms in the background will then match you with someone and you'll end up getting a, a nice uh, a profile page that shows uh, skills, the uh, rating, um, your Cupid score, etc. And um, then we lastly, we have uh, this link, which uh, is the next steps for the moment. It links to our um, uh, GitHub repository. Uh, and so um, if you keep an eye on this, watch the space. Hopefully this will turn into a real thing very soon. Thanks very much, Vanessa.